Hey guys, it's Mark for GeekBeat, and today we're reviewing the Korg Monotron Analog Ribbon Synthesizer. So for those of you familiar with uh, electronic music or you're really into it, you may already know who Korg is, but for those of you who aren't, uh, they make a lot of electronic music gadgets, and this is just one of their other ones. This is for people who want to get into making electronic music, or maybe you're a DJ and you're looking for a kind of crazy sound. This is for you. So let's kind of get into what the Monotron does. Um, this is the on and off switch. Standby is another word for off, apparently. Pitch, cut off, and uh, over here we have pitch control. Over here we have uh, the rate at how many times it's like shooting off the note, so you have a lot, which sounds really scary. That sounds kind of cool, okay. Uh, intensity of how hard it's hitting the notes, like how staccato, or none at all. Flatlining, okay. Um, cutoff over here, what frequency the cutoff is. As you can see, it sounds really painful when it's really high and kind of nice when it's all low. And the peak, I apologize ahead of time. Actually, I was after the fact, but oh well. I apologize either way. All kinds of different options. You can get all kinds of crazy sounds. Volume control is up here on a slider. Uh, auxiliary headphones, because you don't want to be disrupting people with your scary sounding stuff. And a built-in speaker. It's really, really cool. Um, you can get all kinds of crazy sounds from something that sounds like a theremin, old sci-fi space sounding, or even you could pull drum kit sounds out of this. It has a wide range of uses, and I really, really dig it. That's about it for the Korg Monotron. Like I said, makes all kinds of cool, crazy noises, lots of variety, and for 50 bucks, it makes even a cool little toy if you're just looking to mess with some musical stuff. So go check out my full written review right here. I'll put the link right here. And if, for more product reviews, go to youtube.com slash geekbeattv. Bye. You can stop the video now.